everybody on YouTube, what's good? Uh, last night I was so tired, I would make a video. If you are new to the channel, I don't want you to please uh, be sure to subscribe, to like, and comment on my videos if you have any questions. Or comment down below and give me some uh, YouTube video ideas, alright? I'm on my way to work right now. It's almost 8, actually. I'm supposed to be there at 8 30. So, <clears throat> today's video, what I want to talk about is uh, work lingo or lingo difference in America compared to most African countries or where I'm from, my own country, Liberia. Uh, and I'm going to take you through uh, our day in life, this life for me. Uh, so, the first one is like, you know how back home in Africa, whether in a work setting or, or just at a play outside or something like that where you want to get something from your friend or something like that, you say like, oh, can you please give me that? Or, hey, can you please give me that? And then after they give that to you, they you know, take you something like that, like just this common stuff. But uh, here in the United States, they don't say it like that. They will tell you like, uh, hey, let me see that real quick. So that, that kind of surprised me a little bit for the first few times. It kind of shocked me. I was like, because my workman was working and stuff like that. And then uh, it was like, uh, let me see that real quick. And then after I handed it over to him, I think it was a uh, bio or something after I hit it over to him. He started using it. I said, no, that's not see that, bro. Tell me what to use it. No, first time I didn't say something like that, I was, I was just shot. I was like, okay. And then seven times it happened. And not just him, it was with another worker of mine. And then it happened again. I was like, oh, so that's a thing. So when it happened for the fourth time, I was like, yo, why you guys always say like, uh, let me see that real quick? You know, oh, that just a thing here we can say. That's the oh, when I, when I say let me see that real quick, it means that like, I want to use it. So that's something you should keep in mind. Like, uh, it's just the simple stuff, but it's important. And another one is like, uh, if they want you to do something for them, like back home, we will. The second one is like, uh, back home, we will say, like, please help me do that or can you please do that or can you do that for me please something like that we always use please and stuff like that but they don't like uh, what I noticed like uh, it works in me or whatsoever they don't normally say please uh, or it might be where I work they'll be like uh, they'll ask you to do something but they'll ask you I thought it was gonna be like, okay, please open that door for me, just something like that. Or, hey, you wanna, you wanna do that real quick? You wanna do this real quick? They will, they will, they will say it like that, like, you wanna do this, you wanna do that. But, uh, yeah, I try to just like, uh, can you please do that? Or, can you do that real quick? Can you do that? Can you do that? Something like that. They just mean, can you do that? Or they want you to do it, something like that. Are making sense, all right. So that's the second thing that they uh, that's the second thing to have to just like uh, to say all around, like uh, where I have work, be it a work setting or somewhere else, and then someone else want me to like help them out or something. They'll be like, uh, you wanna you wanna do that real quick for me? And it's just it's just common thing, it's something common with uh love that Codens because that's the only city I've been here in my first six months. And another thing again is like uh, something that I love. The third thing is like uh, Americans they like back home we usually say that oh just say you have a good day something like that but they say it but 
in a different way, all right? They'll be like, all right, tennis men have a good one, all right? They'll usually say, like, have a good one. They'll not say, like, have a good day or something like that. They'll tell me that, all right, you bet, have a good one. Yeah, you really tell your boss bye or you tell your friends bye. Alright man, drive safe, have a good one. Like that, they don't usually say it like that. So um almost at work, five minutes to be at work and today I want you guys to play really so wish me good luck. I'll be taking my CDL uh rating test. If you don't know what a CDL is, that's a commercial driver license uh test. So I'll be taking that today. So the CDL is you know, if you get the CDL, you can drive all these uh, trailers and stuff like that. And there's gonna be a big race if I pass my test today. So I'm looking forward to that. I'm nervous about the test because I haven't started for it. Just watched some uh, YouTube videos online last night and a couple of videos this morning while I was getting ready for work. So. I will see you guys when I'm at work, all right? Peace out. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I had a very long day and it wasn't really a good one, but at least I realized something like, uh, I gotta know something about myself today that I didn't know health-wise. So work was pretty busy today and I ran out of uh, power from my phone so i couldn't really do video at work today to show you what i did at work today but i will probably next week i haven't started making my workout video yet because i'm trying to get a membership at a new gym and the gym gonna uh, open on the 13th of this month so watch out for a workout video that's gonna come soon so so this morning I told you guys that I was going to get my CDL. I'm going to do my CDL examination today. But unfortunately when I got there to do the vision test, like uh, I realized that my left eye is 2100 and my right eye is okay, but I need 2040 vision to be able to drive a commercialized vehicle because I'll be driving like this uh, big uh, trailers and stuff like that so i got this uh phone from my from the uh the dmv there telling me that i need to go to any eye clinic because i got my uh vision insurance and stuff like that so i just need to go there and have my eyes checked and probably i'm i might need to start using the glasses or maybe on contact lens or something like that so I don't know how I feel about that one, but I have no option because like it comes with the job. So I will see you guys in the next video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And thank you again for watching my video.